Hey everyone, this is Rufus C. And this is R. Lee. And here we are on Broad River Road, about to turn at this crazy new intersection onto the crazy new on-ramp of I-20 West. Once we're on I-20 West, we'll go under I-26, past the Cloverleaf, <laughs> and back to Bush River Road for the heck of it, because why not? So for several months, about a half a year now, I've watched this bridge we're about to go over get constructed. They built that so that the transit from 20 on to 26 can go under that bridge and keep moving and not have to blend where these two, uh, where the on traffic from here and the off traffic from there are crossing each other. Right. So they, here we go. Off we go. All of this will be a whole different shape here in a year. And eventually the traffic from 20 going on to 26 will go under us and we all keep moving we don't gum each other up and it'll be beautiful and glorious oh yeah so yeah they'll shoot onto the right side of that wall there we'll stay here and here we are glorious old i-20 again going west yes go west young man Westward Ho. And we're going to go past the Cloverleaf and all that good stuff. And hey, here's somebody trying to get in that I want to be uh, courteous to. Oh, a bunch of them. Look at them go. All right. Come on in, trucker. Oh, no. He's got somewhere else to go. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha. Fooled you. Here we are approaching Bush River Road. So that was the transit number 15, number 15 of 20, from Broad River to Bush River here that goes under the bridge. That should stay the same, but there won't be a clover leaf there anymore. No more, right. no more traffic gumming it up. And back to Bush River Road. I feel like I've it was just here. It does. I do live off of Bush River Road. Practically, yeah. I was just here. but we're three quarters of the way through the odyssey of the current traffic patterns around Malfunction Junction. And it'll be a whole lot more Malfunction before it gets to just Junction. Yep. Obey all traffic laws. <laughs> 